Greeting is everyone. So today we're going to talk about the dynamic printing inside Blender. Uh, so I will uh, here going to activate the screencast case. It must will be uh, useful inside our uh, scene or this lesson. Let's uh, first uh, enable the screencast case. And after that, I will uh, say Shift C, add a plane, scale it, and going to the subdivision surface. We will see that the view will be six symbol and apply. So we have here an plane which is uh, big and uh, have a lot of vertex. So after that we will uh, add a monkey or you can add any mesh that will cut through or go inside this uh, uh, this plane. Go here, insert location rotation scale and inside 200 we will say it will go here this plane will go, go here and we will add location rotation scale so if we see we will see that there is some movement uh, and animation of this uh, monkey uh, we will select i will select the plane and say that the plane will be the canvas and add canvas and this one will be the the brush so if we play, we will see that there is some color and there is some movement such as this. This, this is very great and is a good start. So the next step is to change how the dynamic painting uh, change inside our screen. So we will I will go uh, uh, to select the canvas and here is the dynamic bent advanced. This is bent when uh, you can choose it when you want to write on the uh, board but I will select this place and let's see what we have this is this place and uh, it's uh, such as a snow and uh, you have some a tool and cutting through the snow we can make it wet such as this you can select wet so this is very very cool uh, i think let's uh, go again this is very very cool and smooth and you can change this to be 0.4 to have a lot of uh, a lot of waves and the smooth you can change the smooth also and that's it for the dynamic bent inside the blender i hope you enjoy this lesson see you in the next video